Hi guys and welcome to part 3 where I show how to make an endless corridor book nook. If you haven't checked part 1 and 2, I highly recommend to go back and watch those videos first. In this part, I will show you how I decorated the front side of the book nook and added a couple of details inside. I printed a small gothic arc that would fit my book nook. and transferred its silhouette onto the cardboard. To add more dimension, I took several pieces of wire and bent them mimicking the ornament. I hot glued a thread onto the wire using circular motions. I glued these onto the cardboard Painted the whole thing and added some metallic details, like beads and ornaments. Then, using dry brushing technique, I highlighted those ornaments.
I glued them onto the front side. And the book nook was basically ready. However, it was a little bit darker than I expected, so I decided that I need to add more light. I wanted to make something like a runway. So I cut a stripe of red velvet with two golden trims on either side. Then I took a stripe of LED lights and placed lights onto the trims leaving equal amount of distance between the light bulbs. I pushed the light bulbs inside the trim, glued them and checked if they were working. And just when I was going to glue this trim onto the velvet stripe, my camera stopped recording. Basically what I did here, I tuck the strings underneath the velvet and simply hot glue them from both sides. Then I fixed it on the floor and hid the wires. Here you can see how it looks on the floor. And as the very final step, I added one more light string on the ceiling. I made holes with chopsticks on both sides, pushed the lights inside and fixed with hot glue. I didn't push the lights too much, 
just a little bit, so they give light without being visible. I didn't care if it looked messy because I was going to close the roof on top of it and nothing will be visible. This is how my book nook looks on the bookshelf. It's like a little library inside my library that has no end. Thank you guys for watching and I will see you soon.